Ladies and gentlemen, what is going on? Welcome back to a brand new WWE Supercar video for you today. If you guys enjoy Supercar, love the content on the channel, consider hitting the like button, consider subscribing to, subscribing to the channel. They're both free, so doesn't hurt you one bit, and we give you the top-notch Supercar content as always. So we're going to get into where Supercar has messed up dramatically bad, and we're also going to get into right now showing you the preview for the amazing Road to Glory. So this is Team Road to Glory. It is for Daniel Bryan. Now, I don't know if many people would want to play this because it's just a base card. We're literally at the end of the tier. We're about maybe two weeks away, most likely, or three weeks away. Depending on the event this week, we do know it's Giants Unleashed. We just don't know if it's going to be for the base card, for the new tier, you know, all that other stuff. So we don't know yet. Uh, we'll find out more information later this week, of course, to know when the new tier will be coming out. Either Let me just double-check the dates real quick. It will either come out the 3rd or the 10th from what everyone's talking. Most likely, I'm going to say the 10th. My, I think it will be the 10th. But anyways, guys, okay, Daniel Bryan is the card. Now, let's get into the whole controversy part of this episode. <laughs> so, yes, ladies and gentlemen, Class of Champions is finally in the books, done Overall, event-wise, I was pretty happy with it. Now, people are going to ask me questions, so let me hit you up with all the facts and all the other stuff. Edward, what rank did you finish? I finished ranked 85 in the world. Uh, now, the other question. Edward, how much did you freaking spend in credits? Well, to be quite honest with you guys, I've spent a total credit amount of 1,800 credits. Now, after doing the math, I, I've been telling I did like 1.7, but it's clearly towards 1.8. Uh, I did accidentally restore all one time during the event, so that it was 160 credits lost. I spent 125 on a fusion. So roughly, I miss, I did, and then I spent uh, like, I think 150 credits or 100 credits on gear. So I started the event at 9.4, and here I am at 7.3. So I spent, with all those subtracted from mess-ups and stuff, total-wise, I spent 1.8K in credits. Honestly, this was the cheapest event of ever claiming this card, ever. It was the cheapest event, uh, way cheaper than LMS. I spent about 5K on Drew McIntyre. I got rank 112. And this is, I spent 1.8K here, and I got ranked 85. And I'm sure many people spent way more than me, not realizing how to properly play it at the beginning. So I'm just very grateful. 1.8K for rank 85 in the world. Of course, balance is the key in this mode, in my opinion. It's just really slow mode in general. So, but yeah, we did finish ranked 85 in the world, which means I'm going to get pretty much the ninth best card in the game, pretty much. Uh, which I'm happy with. Uh, I wanted to finish in the top 254. That was my goal. And we finished way above that. And now the problem is, though, is the proc is broken on this card. It only goes up to about 33, 34K. So that clearly needs to be fixed. If it's like an LMS card, this should be about 80 something K like Drew McIntyre, but it's not. But, so yeah. The problem is, though, is when you try to claim this card. It tells you that you're rank zero and you don't get the rewards. Now this has been a while now. Supercard have not addressed anything yet. We're still waiting to see what they do. Many people have already tried to claim it and they haven't gotten jack crap. I think only rank one in the world so far has gotten the card, which is my my boy Adam. He just hit me up on Twitter. Shout out to you, Adam. Congrats on number one. He is the only one I know so far that has the card. As you can see, like you go to other ranks. You don't see anyone else with Bret Hart, and you would assume it's right now, currently 1.38 p.m. This event ended at 9 a.m., and you just don't see people at all. Like, here's rank one in the world, Drew, but you don't see his rank. Where'd he finish? Six. You don't see his six card in the world. Or uh, Cock, he would have this done in one shot. Doesn't have his card up there. Jaraxel doesn't have his card. These guys would have their cards done, ready to go. Coach Dubs, uh, buddy as well, my buddy. Uh, they would have his card up. But again, 
these cars are not up right now and they're clearly broken so only rank one in the world was able to claim his card just fine and this is his stats his bret hart now he does tell me he does have the hammer on this card and overall it is a really really powerful card man however the proc is 34.5k clearly broken uh, they have to fix that clearly or else drew mcintyre will you know eat this card up for breakfast <laughs> for most people so yeah only rank one in the world currently has the card nobody else and eventually this will be fixed guys it will be fixed uh how long who knows uh in my suggestion you know just wait for them to fix it i know it's really really annoying that supercard hasn't done anything at all it's been hours, but again, it is Memorial Day weekend, so some people are probably off today. It is Monday. I'm sure some people will be heading to the office, though, but yeah, they will eventually fix this. Just be patient. It's unfortunate, but yeah, just don't overreact, guys. But overall, I'm very, uh, I was very satisfied with Clash of Champions. I think there do need to be improvements on this mode to make it more better. Procs need to be fixed. I think the balance issue needs to be fixed. Having, like, needing 16 cards like for this event mode is just too much uh it just will put a strain on people i would say if you can make it like 10 where you only need 10 cards it would be so much better so you get round one round two of course then round three would make no sense to super card but again round three is so unuseless i don't think anyone purchased bouts for it unless you were really dumb and just very like unpatient with stuff Round three was just a waste of credits. You just start the bout over again and go where you know Sean or Brett was. So they have a, they could do a lot more improvements on this mode, and I hope they do improve it. Uh, but for what it was, or as it is, and late in the tier, it was all right. So yeah, guys, uh, there really isn't much besides this whole controversy that Supercard effed up. So all we have to do now is wait to get our rewards. And uh, so yeah, thank you guys for watching. I will see you on this episode. Like, comment, subscribe. Catch you later. Peace.